Mm, those things look like hairless deer. All right, welcome back to Metroid Dread. This looks like uh, Gavorn, and it already feels like fusion, actually. Um, what is this? So there's a green cover here, and my guess is that we're going to be picking up some... Oh, okay, we're going to be picking up some items. Uh, this is, I guess, the other section of Gavorn that was from... Cataris? I think that's the teleporter that we took over here from Cataris. Now we're entering, I guess, um, Gavorn proper. Like the actual way that you get into this place. Uh, yeah, this feels like fusion. Jungle area? Um, also, I, I think in the previous part, uh, a lot of things happened. We found out that Samus was a, uh, well, first off, I guess it's kind of obvious, but Samus can speak Chozo. Uh, another thing is that she has a voice in this game. Um, we met another Chozo called, I think his name was Quiet Robe. And he told us that um, the Chozo that attacked us is like leader of a warrior tribe of Chozo. And he um, is trying to, I guess, breed Metroids or grow Metroids. Uh, the issue with that is that during the events of Summer's Returns, which is the second Metroid game, we eradicated all of the Metroid in the area, or on planet, um, what was it, SR388? We just, we killed, we destroyed all the Metroid in that game. So now there are no Metroid left, but um, because we were injected with a Metroid serum, I think during the fourth game, Metroid Fusion, and if you haven't seen Metroid Fusion, I have a couple parts of that up, so you guys should take a look at that, huh? Uh, what is this? Oh. Yeah, it's a, it's a spider. Okay. Because we've, um... Oh, this thing. I keep thinking this is like that little thing that spouts out like lava. I guess they do different things, but because, um... We got injected with the Metroid Serum in the previous game... We are the only... Oh my gosh! Uh, right, this thing, you you have to use the, what is it called, the flash shift? You gotta use the, uh, you gotta use the flash shift. You can parry him when he, was, so these things are like Chozo robots, I saw um, in the in the mission log. And you just gotta run around and fire missiles at him. The game, keep, like, you have so much room to run around. I'm surprised. Ah! Uh, ah. They take a lot of HP off, though. Uh. Okay. Ah. Ah. I'm kind of, I'm, I'm a little bit, I'm a bit too afraid to parry. Ah! <laughs> yeah, I'm too afraid to parry. I got to work on that. Okay, uh, so this thing, I, uh, I gotta work on pairing it. I keep, um, uh, when he does the blue, when he does, like, the blue strikes, the blue strikes come out much faster than the red ones, which is, like, you know, you really don't have any time to actually jump in the air and, uh, do an aerial flash shift. Also, Samus can do three of these things in a row. I didn't know she could do three of them in a row. Um, but anyway, hold on. Okay, I thought it was a cutscene. Um... The, the the guy that we talked to, Quiet Robe, he was, I guess, killed by um, one of these Chozo robots. And 
I think with the the guy that attacked us in the beginning of the game, Ravenbeak. He oh, Ravenbeak uh, wants to you know make more Metroids, but we destroyed all the Metroids. We're the only ones with Metroid DNA because in Fusion we got injected with it when we had to deal with the X. Uh, so now he's trying. He I guess he lured me here, or he lured us here, because um, Samus is the only one that has Metroid DNA now. And I guess our only job is to get out of this place. Okay, so what is down here? Oh gosh. Yeah, that's what I thought that the little tongue monster was gonna be. There's something over here, right? Yeah, okay. That looks like something that blows up. But I guess not. Um, do I want to go down there or do I want to stay up top? I'll keep going down. Oh! Okay. Uh, I'll say, uh, I think I said previously in the, uh, in the previous part, but I do think that we are on... How do you run this? You gotta hold ZR and then fire. Okay. I do think that we are on the last, like the the latter half of the game now, because the game has. Uh, I guess we now know the point of our being here. Oh, man. Oh, I can't go any further anyway. Okay, so there's a weapon that I'm gonna get because I'm seeing a lot of green hatches in this area, and this is the only place that we can go. We can't go any. We can't go to any other spots. So we're going to pick up some items. It's probably um, super missiles, if I could guess, because I think there was, that was a super missile cover, like the green one, because the regular missile covers are red. So that's just a spot I gotta come back to later when I get the super missiles. Okay, I appreciate if you guys are still watching with me. Uh, I appreciate you guys for sticking in there with me. Um, I think this time next month I'll be all done with classes for the year. And it'll be back to playing whatever I choose to play. Uh, I do want to give this, uh, this is a game by Yoko Taro. Or I guess he, he directed it. And it's called, I think, Isle of Cards. And from what I can tell, it's like an RPG. It's a it's an RPG, but with a card game aesthetic. And here's another cover. But that's not a okay. So there's something <laughs> there's something here that we're gonna have to fight. And right, right, because Quiet Robe, um, he deactivated all the Emmy. You know, I didn't even notice that the thing was. I didn't even notice that this was. I went into an Emmy zone. Because I'm also used to hearing the beeping. So that's what they do. They hide in the foreground then. Okay. Uh, that's right. I keep shooting toward the ground, but the game tells you when something's hidden in an area or not. Uh, this is cool. It's, like, it's kind of like Jurassic Park. Blow those things up, whatever they are. Uh, okay. So far we're going in a linear, linear direction. Uploading data. Samus, you are approaching the surface. This area, Gavarin, appears to be an underground forest. Never mind, it's called Gavarin, not Gavarin. The enemy have been deactivated, but Ravenbeak still desires the Metroid DNA within you. I have reviewed the video log of your encounter after your arrival. You were no match for him then. You are no match for him now. <laughs> it is true that you have recovered many of your combat abilities. However, my analysis suggests that you would not be a worthy adversary for him, not even at full power. <laughs> She's always got somebody that's one up in her. One thing still eludes me. Why did Raven Beat spare you during that encounter? Something must have motivated him. Mm -hmm. Hmm. 
she's the best bounty hunter in the galaxy and she still gets one up by something in all of her games. Like effortlessly one up too. Oh gosh, that's right. This thing. I'll be glad if I do this super missiles, because these missiles not. They're not putting in the work they used to. Um So this thing. Yeah, like that green thing, that's a super missile cover. Ah. So that says there's a hidden There's a hidden something. But I can't exactly figure out what it is. So I'll keep uh okay. I'll keep moving. Ah, uh, where is this? Yeah, these spiders are creepy. Okay. No? So I gotta come through there from another area? Access closed. Have I been there before? I have. Access closed. Okay, so I come through there from another another side. And I can't access it from above. Nope. Okay. Uh, uh, no. uh, ah. Alright, chase it. Ah, ah. Oh, okay. It absorbs your it absorbs your energy. I get it. <laughs> this place is kind of fun. <laughs> okay, so what's over here? Uh, where does this lead to? It leads back to Dyron. Okay, a different section of Darren, I guess. So I'll check that out later. And what else we got? Yeah, like this is a... That's a super missile cover. Here we go. Uh, what? Man, that thing is fast. Yeah, you don't get much reaction time. I like it when those little things fly off. Okay, that looks like that looks like a super missile. Yep. I think it was pretty obvious. <laughs> we ran across so many hatches. Okay. Uh, a stronger version of the missile. Hold R and press Y to fire. Consumes missile ammo that can destroy super missile covers. Now, I don't remember how Fusion ran things, but I thought in Fusion, regular missiles used one missile and super missiles used five? Oh. And I guess this thing... Uh, right, right, right. Grapple beam. This, that thing I just destroyed, I guess it's immune to regular missiles. So now, hey, <laughs> much better. Yeah, we're much stronger. I appreciate that because these missiles were, the missiles I had were showing their age. Uh, I can't get up here though. I think that's where the, yeah, that's where that missile tank, pl missile plus tank was. Um. I have no idea what these red things are. Still. Where are we going? I don't think we've cleared everything out. We haven't. There's another hatch, but that's a... Okay, so that's like... A beam... A beam hatch. That I gotta get. I think. Power beam door. Okay. So where am I? Okay, climb my way back up all the way around. And then hit this power beam door, so pass the save room. Okay. Oh, never mind. Here's one right here. Yeah, super missile cover. There are two super missile covers.
Oh, what we got? <clears throat> oh, that's right. Um, while I spent, oh, okay, this is the other side. While I spent quite a bit of time um, doing schoolwork, I uh, I kind of got sick, and I think it was from. As weird as it is to say, I think it was from overwork. I was uh, I was only giving myself like four hours of sleep. I was giving myself like four hours of sleep, and then I was spending like twelve hours after school, before class, after class, and then on days I didn't have class, I was at the school as well. So this is where I need to be. I still don't know what the hidden secret is here. Oh, I can use the scampers. Give me a second. All right, what do you got? I don't see anything. So it's probably just where that red plant is. Oh gosh. Oh. Okay. So how many super missiles does it take to kill this thing? It takes one for the spiders now. Oh. Okay. Oh, speed booster. Okay. Um, another thing I noticed while uh, reviewing some of my older videos is that you can you can hit the speed booster sections by using a, um, a shine spark. But I don't think I don't think I have enough of a running start to actually do it. Unless I ran out and immediately fired off it like that. Okay. Going through pretty fast. Um. Alright, this is all still new stuff. Uh. Let me make sure I'm not missing something still. No, I do believe that's everything. Um, so let's see. Which one will I hit first? I will hit from Gaffarin, I will go to Dyrin. I'll take the Dyrin elevator first because I don't think I'm required to activate I don't think I'm required to destroy a super missile cover. Alright, so I'll check out the Dyron elevator first, and then I'll come back and see whatever the elevator I just passed was. Okay. Back in Dyron, this is... Another closed off spot. Okay. And we got that's a cold area. I still need to grab these two. Wow. <laughs> okay. That fills up the hell. And can I can I get up here? Uh that is a no. So uh, what is that? An energy tank, energy tank part, and it's another frozen door. So I can't come here until after I get the gravity suit. Period. But this is just this leads you into Gavern. Okay, so I'm not meant to come here anyway. All right. So uh, welcome back. If this is a new part. Uh, we are in this place called Ellen, and comparatively speaking, it is, I got three more Emmy left to deal with in the game. 
uh, this place, Ellen, is a very small spot. So that makes me think something story related is going to happen here. Um, no doubt it's not going to be anything good. Um, I'm still seeing some green hatches, so there's some kind of beam or something that I need. I don't know if it's like the, I think it's the plasma beam, I'm thinking. Um, wide beam, diffusion beam, grapple beam. It might be the plasma beam. If it's in this game. Those are cameras? What's in here? Uh, okay, that's not good. Okay, so whatever I need, I don't have yet. Huh. Oh boy. <laughs> I'm seeing a lot of destroyed statues. Oh. <laughs> Okay. There's only one way, there's only one path, and that's up. That's not supposed to be here. There's a bit. There's a there's an X here. I can't even I can't even just damage this thing. Yeah, yeah an X parasite mimicking an enemy will revert to its original gelatinous form when defeated. Some can absorb the X to replenish energy and ammo. And it looks like they. It looks like they do the same things they did in Fusion too. The X are being held in here? So Raven Beak was experimenting with the Metroid and the X? Uh, okay, that's not good. Uh, I'm not seeing anything. Oh, that's right. Give me a second. Okay, cool. Whew. Okay. Am I gonna be playing Metroid Fusion again? Uh, the way the way the X parasites work is that if uh, Samus can absorb them because she has. All right, you can't you can't actually damage the thing. You have to parry it. Some, see, they gave me super missiles, and now they gave me an opponent that super missiles don't work on. Uh, uh, is this thing an X parasite too? I can't even damage that. Oh my god, this one's a parasite too. 
it killed everything. Uh. It killed everything, man. What was I saying? The the green X parasites restore your HP. The yellow ones restore um No, no, no. I'm sorry. The yellow ones restore your HP. The green ones restore your missiles and the red ones will store a lot of HP and missiles. Is this the, the plasma beam I think? Plasma beam acquired. This isn't good. <laughs> Why are the X here? Fires a powerful stream of plasma that can pierce through multiple enemies. Oh, that's helpful. And damage robotic enemies. Oh, without the need to charge, press Y to fire. It can also destroy plasma beam covers. So we're going to go back to Gavorin after we finish here. Dude, the X kills everything, man. Nothing survives these things. Uh. Yeah, they're doing the same things they did in Fusion where you destroy them and they... They move someplace else and turn into another enemy. Uh, uh. I can't even damage this thing. Uh, where am I going? Plasma beam covers, right? There's something in that space. Oh gosh. Yeah. Uh, so what if, like, what if the X killed, like, all the Chozo, right? Like, what if Ravenbeak is actually an X mimicking Ravenbeak and the actual Ravenbeak was killed by the, by the X? Is there another? No? Oh, that's a different spot. Give me a second. Let me see if I can find out what the secret is. Okay. Okay, you can only damage that thing while it's down like that. A speed booster? Okay, I know I know this puzzle. Alright, so we can We can hit that. We gotta go quickly. Yeah, I think I, I took too long. <laughs> Alright, that's a nice little little puzzle. Okay, so we can uh These things are taking like four super missiles. Okay, yeah, so those are the plasma beam covers. Okay. Oh, it's from the other side. Uh, these things are doing quite the amount of damage. Okay. Oh, a lot of rare ones. Okay, so this is a boss. Are you a robot or? Oh. Oh. <laughs> I 
Okay. Ah! I gotta remember. He jumps the length of the. Oh. Alright, that was easy. Oh! <laughs> oh my gosh, they kill everything. They kill everything, dude. Oh. Okay. Oh. Man, he does a does a longer lunge too. I thought, yeah. Okay, so I had the right idea, but I was, I was too early on the parry. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Did I get him? Uh, I right, get him! Yeah! Ugh. Okay, so they killed that. I don't know if it was a warrior or a robot. Whatever it is, the X killed it. Alright, so this is. Uh, this lets me go higher up. Uh, maybe I should just use a scan pulse to see. Yeah, I had a feeling it was on the other side. Okay. Yeah, I, di I didn't want to take a chance on crossing a point of no return and not being able to get that energy tank until later. Uh, so we have to go through the plasma door. So everything else we can check out. Oh man. I think I'm gonna be playing Metroid Fusion from now on. Well maybe not, because because they're they're only containing this area. Oh gosh. Uh claustrophobic! Move that. Okay, so that's as far as that goes. That's an unbreakable. None of that, huh? Hmm. Okay, here we go. Those are all on. What are you doing? Oh my gosh. Ah! Yeah. That's what they do. Um. Anything here? No. I'm trying to get back up around. Here we go. Oh, su oh, power bombs. Okay. All right. Well, that's a bummer. I can't go any further from there then. Okay, so I am going to come back to this place later. Okay, here we go. Uh, but I can get I can get this though, right? Yeah, an unknown resource has been acquired. You cannot use this item yet. Okay. Where are the power bombs? That's the second one of those uh, tanks I've gotten. Okay, so from here, from here, where do I go? Yeah, so I can't actually stop them until after they land. 
Okay. So now they're probably all gonna power up. They're gonna power up all of the enemies I previously fought. Hmm. Not good. So we're going back to Gavorin. And we gotta hit all of those plasma beam covers. <laughs> 